is that they have been using such money. On Sunday, the president announced that final year students would return to school on 15th October. Parliament's Education Committee met Education Ministry officials to hear what arrangements have been made for the students and their teachers. I would be very interested in a clear program or a clear proposal by the ministry on reopening of schools. We are reluctant to send those uh, guidelines until they are approved. We, we are finalizing now the approval. The MPs asked for clear guidelines on the operations of day schools, which may not have housing facilities for their students and their teachers. We want the, the, the teachers to be in, in the schools. And we want the cooks, uh, the support staff, to remain within the school wherever is possible. But where they go out, Mr. Chairman, we have recommended and we have been working with the Minister of Health. They will have to be um, quarantined when they come back. Very few schools in this country have permanent houses for teachers at schools. Now, you tell me that a teacher who has gone to school A or B, C to teach sciences, you will quarantine him under which arrangement? You've quarantined that teacher for 14 days. If after 14 days the teacher wishes to go back to a certain school, is also quarantined for another 14 days. That is a month. The ministry's permanent secretary says the term's length has not been determined. We are opening for term two. So we want to make sure that we put all the things they were supposed to do now into the remaining two terms. So term two, we shall have term three, and then we will do exams at an appropriate time. It is not clear yet when the other students will return, but government says arrangements to keep them busy are in place. We will share the program on radio and TV is also going to continue. The future length of the 9 million radios for all households uh, uh, with the learners is ongoing, and this will ensure that no child is left behind in home schooling. The health ministry will provide a face mask for every student, no extracurricular activities allowed at the school, there will be a health committee for each school, the capitation grant will be released to allow schools to prepare for the reopening, and all schools will be required to have temperature guns and disinfectant. Private schools will provide their own. <laughs>